Hi, everybody. I'm the last one. Thanks for sticking around. Um, Latifa Faisal, I think I know just about everybody here, um, Story County Board of Supervisors. Um, I, I, again, want to echo everything that's been said. There's a lot of really um, disturbing things happening in Des Moines, uh, in Washington. It's just, it's a little overwhelming. Um, but one thing I, I just want to make sure that um, that I'm pointing out also is it's, it's also the, the consolidation of control that's happening in Des Moines and the pulling back of any local control, anything that we can decide for ourselves. We can't decide you know, where all of our, where, where our um, mental health funding will go. We can't, I mean we can, but it's changed. Um, there are a whole lot of things. It seems like every time we take one step forward, we get pulled back two or three steps. Um, I spoke with a woman this morning at the Slater Parade, and she proudly informed me that she used to be a Democrat, but now she's an independent because she got tired of all the phone calls and all of the people bothering her all the time. So she registered as an independent, but at her heart, she is still a Democrat. Um, and we were just chatting about how different Iowa is now, and how how could we go from being a state that was so welcoming and opened our arms to immigrants and refugees that needed a place to, to come and stay? How could we be? Yeah. How could we be leaders in LGBTQ rights and now be where we are right now? Um, I, We've got to, we have to keep talking to people. We have to keep working. We have to keep finding connection with people because uh, that's the only way we're going to move forward is continuing to talk about the things that matter and the things that are important to people and finding those points where we align and, and focusing on that. And we gotta get some kids in here, you guys. Like, oh my God, we've got the university right here. We have got to get some kids in here, and I don't know how we're gonna do that. I, I keep talking about it at home, but I don't have any bright ideas. So um, you invited them. Thank you for inviting them. <laughs> anyway, happy Fourth of July. Thank you for coming. Thank you for organizing it, and um, it is wonderful to see everybody. Thank you.